When Pakistan tested its 60 km range tactical nuclear missile, the Nasser, a few months ago, the message was clear. It now had the weapon to block any Indian military thrust into Sindh or Punjab. But Indian scientists say a ground-based ballistic missile defense system they are working on will take care of any missile challenge, whether from the Nasser or long-range missiles Pakistan has in its inventory. We can intercept these missiles at uh, exo-atmospheric range that is beyond 40 to 50 kilometers in altitude and endo-atmospheric uh, bracket that is between 15 and 30 kilometers. This gives us uh, capability to take care of uh, missiles which are ballistic in nature, which could be nuclear powered, which could be non-nuclear powered. But right now this is work in progress with more tests of the missile interceptor planned for this year. Development of the first phase will be complete only in 2013. Thereafter begins the integration of ground systems into a seamless network. Today all the building blocks of BMD are in position. We have the radars, we have the command control systems, we have the interceptors, we have the mobile launchers which can be used. We have the necessary command control communication, decision making software which is in place. So as far as the phase one activities as I mentioned to you earlier are concerned, they are by and large completed. It's only in 2016 that work on the more ambitious second phase of the missile defense network will be complete. That's when the contours of India's space-based missile defense system will be revealed. In New Delhi, Surya Gangadhar.